You know, one of the fundamental th things that companies can do when they have a major capital expenditure project is to, to use a failure modes effect analysis, or FEMA is what's called in industry. The whole idea is to identify what could go wrong, what should we do about it, and plan for that. It's no more than that. So you go through from the beginning and the end of the project, you use a cross-discipline team within the company, identify things that could happen either internally or externally that could cause delays, over budget, other kinds of risks with the project. Once you identify those, figure out what's the likelihood of that occurring. Next, what's the impact of that? Figure out what your mitigation plan is. You do that on a very rigorous basis. You identify what happens, what you're gonna do about it, and plan for the inevitable. There always are bumps in the road, but by using this as a tool, companies are ready and able to make the changes necessary for the project to be successful. From a budget standpoint, when people are thinking about major capital expenditures, they do a really good job of the hard cost, you know, the building costs, the machinery costs, those fundamental things. The things where they may fall down are on the soft cost. What's it gonna take to ramp up? What are some of the planning and training uh, costs you might have? And thinking about the contingencies you identify when you did your project management. Make sure that you synchronize across both the budget and the project management piece so that you may have identified something as a risk early on and even a likelihood of it occurring, but if you forget to include it in your budget, that's a miss. Taking that all together, including an appropriate contingency, companies can come up with the right measurement to figure out what's this gonna cost so they can make the right choice when they decide to invest millions of dollars in a major capital expansion.